Hello, everybody, and welcome back to the Banner Saga. We're back with the Varl. We're not gonna fuck up this time. We know what to do, and we know how to do it. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully. All right. Okay. <clears throat> oh, so That's Ubin is no Ubin. longer in charge. Hmm. Actually, I'm, do you want to be hack on or Ubin? Because it feels weird if I'm just taking it up all of it. Like, well, I guess you are Rook. I don't know. Hmm. What do you think? Well, I'm fine with whatever, honestly. <clears throat> Alright, you can be hack on for now. Alright. <clears throat> so you knew him well, did you? <laughs> Didn't you? Wagner? No. Ah, well, I don't know. I remember him. Always rushing around with some important business, but I never knew him. Never got a chance to talk much. Longer than I did, in any case. I suppose so. When you spoke, Varl listened. I knew that. I could use help there. The Scrivener leans back, considering the sentiment. I've seen worse. They respect you for your ability to swing an axe. They need to respect you for your, more, ah, for your actions. But you're not talking to the right Varl. Mogar's got some skill there. Most I can do is hold a quill. Mm. Yeah, what are you writing down? Yeah. How do you mean? What do I write? I write what happens. They've got a banner in uh, Arborong for that, you know. You mean Long Banner? Yes, the Menders wove up something that writes its own history. You want my opinion? I don't trust it. No. It tells a broad story. I think there's some value in the narrow. Whose story does it write? Mine? Theirs? Luden's? Gods forbid. Ha! <laughs> you relic. The gods have been dead a long time. Oh, have they? Old habits, I suppose. <clears throat> I heard you were tearing your day. Yeah, he looks like he could fuck some shit up. He's old and a little bit fat, but he's still huge. Do you know how old I am? Dare I ask? I'm competing, you know. Nobody knows how old we Varl can get, naturally. There's one by the name of Snorri. He's got a few years on me. Just hunkers in Grofheim collecting rhyme. Bastard might actually beat me. <laughs> Another one named Krummer is close, I think. But the adult son of a bitch still welcomes a fight. Yeah. He'll probably be off before I am. Although... A scrivener gestures around him as if to remind you of the current situation. You chuckle. Anyway, point is, what difference does it make? I'm just a delivery baron for Jorinder now. Jorinder. Can't remember half of what I've done. Yeah, hence the journal? Hence. Don't get fancy on my behalf, Hakon. Okay, I won't. Uh, yeah, what, what happened to the happen sun? <clears throat> what do you think? Gods, how should I know? Never seen anything something like this before. It, well, given this sort of <sighs> mythology, it's probably something related to Skull and Hadi. Maybe. I not you worried. Some of the Vile in the caravan think the world's coming to an end. Others think it's the best thing that could happen. No more black months. I'll take it. If it's the end, I'm ready. <laughs> what about the rest of us? To the depths with you. <laughs> ha! Uh, you consider all right. Get some rest. I've hoofed more hills than a horse born with a grudge. Don't worry about me. Horse born? Is there horse people? Did someone fuck a horse? Is that what are I'm... there centaurs? And or there is, there is much to that implicate. Mean, here. That means centaurs. There's someone who is like a horseback rider, you know, hmm. like horseback soldiers. Yay! Eric's oh, back. Hey. Yay! Promote. All right. So obviously we want uh, more armor. Actually, he was pretty armor damn, He already has two on him. Look at that. Hmm. Although his will pool is surprisingly low. Yeah. Should I buff that, or do you think we should go all out in the armor? Breakage, that is. Because um, if, if he naturally does three, you know, five on top of that, that's pretty good. Yeah, that's true. Hmm. 
Although, he won't be able to do much if it's constantly running out. Ding, ding. That's also true. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna go yeah, with Will Power. one in there. Yeah. Fuck it. What is his special thing? Rally. Uh, do, 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 do. Needed. Doesn't use a bow like a hunter. Rally allows him to grant willpower to allies from anywhere in the battle. Oh, okay, so he's more support. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Ah, uh, okay. And Gunolf is still injured. Uh, Our uh, other guy is dead. Gunolf and Hakon are both injured, and... Oh, God. Right, this is not... The other guy we had with us died. Mogar can upgrade. Yeah, upgrade at least. Alright, he's already He's, he's two. got two. Ooh. Ooh, well, we gotta link him up to two. Yeah. What the dodge? Hmm. Or lucky shot. Lucky shot. Oh, it's either or. Uh, avoid What's strength that, the lucky attack. Shot? Avoid strength attack. Thirty percent bonus hit chance. Hmm. That is helpful. Although, maybe we should really start going. He's shield master. All if we can make him a real tank, that'll be some shit. Because they'll have to spend oh, yeah. all their time breaking down his defense. He's already huge. Look at that, 15. I don't think even the Dredge have 15 strength, naturally. They gotta whittle him down. Yeah. So that's something, at least. All right. I don't uh... need to rest, because they will not recover unless you rest. Okay. Is that map? No. Is this... I... Yes. I don't know if there actually is a rest. Because I can go. Oh, well, we can't to rest here, it seems. Map, yeah, talk to Moger. Mm. Alright. <laughs> That's how you're dealing with the Vogner's death, but I already know the answer. Do you? Steady, old Moger. Which is good. I know most of the Varro, but they're not under my command. They came to follow Vogner. Tell you the truth, I wouldn't want to be in your position either. Uh, so, yeah, is there anything you can tell me about it? Throw together this many Varl, half of them want to hit each other. The rest want to be left alone. Yeah, anyone I should keep an eye on. There's a couple of clan leaders trying to show off for each other. Not a big deal. I've got it under control. The hmm. fighters we just got from Strand aren't bad, but they're unruly. Give it a few days. And there are a few moaning about fighting for you instead of Wagner. Those are the ones to worry about. <clears throat> what about Luden's men? Uh, they don't want to hear anything from me. I know that. Any problems? Could be. Luden's pet Varl is named Bercy. I'm not sure where he came from or what his deal is. Bastard knows how to fight, but there's something I don't like about him. His girl in red is scary too. Yersa. She's probably the best fighter Luden's got, to be honest. I've overheard some Varl call her the witch. Oh, she has magic. Mm. Why? The flaming arrows, ah. I think. It's a good trick, but the fire upsets our Varl more than the dredge. So it doesn't make much sense. Which? They're not scholars, Hakon. I think they're mostly just afraid of her. <laughs> that makes more sense. Don't let her find out. Um... Haven't you ever wanted to be in command? <clears throat> more than I am. Any more rope and I'd hang myself. I doubt that. I forget, you weren't around back in then. At one point, I had more rope. I hung myself. So no, I'm not interested in command. It's all yours. Thanks. Uh, yep. <laughs> yeah, you think you're walking into a death trap? <clears throat> this many Varl? No. We should be alright. Things could get rough, though. <clears throat> I don't like being the one to send Varl to their deaths. I like worrying about myself, and that's the extent of it. Who would have expected Vogner to drop like that to a couple of slag? I'm still wondering what happened. He had hundreds of dead slag to his name. I don't get it. It was Luden. He was taking the hits to protect Luden. Mm. Just happens sometimes. No big moment. Most likely. I'm sure it surprised him even more than us. Although I have to wonder... Nah, never mind. You don't think Luden stuck him in the back, do you? Personally, I doubt that. I think it was he was wanted to bring peace and just kept the prince alive. You know, dying because of it. Anyway, 
I'll worry about the Warriors. You worry about not doing something stupid. No, it's asking a lot. I know, fuckface. <laughs> Are you holding Alright, raise your shield. <laughs> <laughs> I'd rather not say, Hakon. Why not? It's the kind of thing that gets stuck in your head, and you need a clear one. It's better if you let me worry about it. Uh, we could trust him, or we could get the details. Ah. Uh, Mogur does seem to know what he's doing. Yeah, if you say so, keep it to yourself. Alright. If there's a reason right, to bring it up again, I will. <laughs> Alright then. Let me know if keep you need anything else. I will. Wonderful. Wonderful. <clears throat> Alright, so we can't rest. All we can do is get out of here. We have 65 days of supplies. No clans. We've got a we big gotta caravan. Mm. I guess this is the best we're going to get, so let's get going. Maybe the new people will join? No. So, at some point, we're going to converge. Most likely. Man, our banner does not look that big. Look at that, says Mogner. In the hills, more dredge. No more than a dozen, though. We could just as easily pass by as rush up there to slaughter them. Luden over here. That's a dozen dredge heading towards Strand. You asked him when he started to care about Strand. I don't. I thought you did. <sighs> we should go deal with it. Right? In a dozen. We could send warriors to take care of it. We'll probably lose them, though. But our people ourselves are injured. Or we could leave yeah. them and Strand will probably get destroyed. Which... Potentially. But we kind of want Strand, don't we? What do you think? Send some warriors, or should we go deal with it ourselves? We never got to rest with these guys, so they'd be injured starting out. Should be at a disadvantage right from the get-go. But if we it have will to go be more XP. 12. It will be more XP. Oh, 12. Fuck. Alright, should we send some warriors to deal with it? Sure. All right. Um, oh, you're talking to somebody else. Sorry. No, yeah, this is one ice cream. Okay. Uh, should we send some people? I think we really should. Okay. We'll do, he says. Hopefully, they'll be able to catch back up to the caravan. He rushes off to find some volunteers. Luden and his men are not asked. You return to travel. Oh, we got some <laughs> renown. They're minus ten varl. Ten varl against twelve dredge. Hack on! You hear Luden's hard booted trot as you set up camp the first day. Embrace yourself. Can we speak as equals? We can try. It seems clear to me you plan to kill a lot of dredge on the way, am I right? Uh. You're not wrong. Then listen carefully. Don't assume the Varl can, only the Varl can fight. Do you understand me? That is my banner we fly to Grofheim. The banner of Arborong. I insist on joining in battle. Almost got in your first encounter and ready for more. Whatever you like, Prince. And, uh, I expected more resistance. From Wagner, maybe. Yeah, I don't give a shit about you. You can go die in a hole for all I care. Huh? Somebody messaging me? What the fuck? <clears throat> Sure. Oh, never mind. They tell me you are his kinder. That's why you're in charge now. Some sort of next of kin varl thing? Don't you take on his responsibilities? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe not that one. That's a little too standoffish. Yeah. Like, in my, uh, why the tough act? Eh. Yeah, why the probably... tough act? Alright. Don't look down on me again. Don't you dare. When you're nearly 200 years, it's hard to take a 20-year-old man. Is that right? Seriously. You'd better start. We'll both be kings someday. <laughs> That's the last thing I need to think about right now. Oh my god, that is a terrifying thought. Lun looks as though you just punched yourself in the face. He heads back to his tent before saying whatever was on his mind. Mm. I hope we handled that right. I don't think we did. Mm. 
Honestly. Probably not. Honestly. On exertion, you've gotten some characters with high exertion. Don't overlook this important step. Exertion lets you add more willpower to your actions. Want to add more than one star to your <clears throat> Want to add more than one star to your attack? Upgrading to three exertion lets you add three damage to every attack. Or move three spaces oh. further than usual if you've got the willpower for it. Remember, each stat is equally important in combat. Choose wisely. Very good to know. Alright. Uh, so you should uh, rest first. Okay, let me just look at the heroes real quick and see what our situation is. Oh, yeah, we do have people now. So I don't have to rest. They'll be fine if I just keep them out of the battle. We have one other person. We have Yirsa and Bursi. Yes. Okay, okay. Let's take Leave. a look at what Yirsa... Okay, so she's a siege archer. Kind of squishy in the damage and the health. Auto 2, 1... Mm, okay. Slag and burn. The character throws a five tile area of slag on the ground, which explodes immediately. I like that. Targeted tile takes the damage seen below. Armor break zero. Two strength damage leaves up to two coals. Oh, so we leave fire over the floor. It also leaves randomly placed burning coals on unoccupied tiles. If targeting an empty tile, coals always appear on the center tiles first. Walking over the burning coals causes mm -hmm. one strength damage. Interesting. Okay. Better see what you got. He kind of looks like... Oh, he's a Warhawk. Okay, cool. So him and... He's like, uh... He's hey, like Gunnolf. my wolf... Gunnolf. Yeah. Why did, I say... Why did I think Wolfnir? Who's Wolfnir? I have no idea. What? What the... Might have been the guy that died. Hmm. Alright, so he's still injured. You're right. I should probably rest. Uh... Should we talk to the people, or do you want to rest first? Because we might be attacked. Let's talk to the people. Alright. Irsa, right? She watches you approach with her head tilted back and points a thumb towards Luden's tent. Uh, no, here for you. Oh? Can we talk? Irsa shakes her head no. A smile on her I lips, eyelids low. Why not? I don't. In those two curiously contradictory words, you get two impressions. She has a beautiful obsidian voice, and this might be a complete waste of time. Well, it's about the flaming arrows. Yeah, yeah it's about the flaming arrows. She raises an eyebrow. The viral and fire don't get along. All you get is a shrug. If we're going to use them. She pulls an arrow. There's a flick of the wrist you don't quite catch. Suddenly, a bird combusts in the tree behind you and falls to the ground, smoldering. Half the camp has turned to watch. Don't tell me not to. Great. I mean, I was going to say not to. No. You do, though. I don't. Jesus Christ. Yeah. He smiles warmly, clearly enjoying her game. <laughs> Uh, you're Luden's bodyguard. You're Luden's bodyguard? No, he's mine. Before even a chance to be confused, she cackles, abrupt and loud, then looks slightly embarrassed. <laughs> you are his personal guard, though? Her expression changes to, of course. And how did you end up with someone like Luden? Luck. Well, well this, this has, has been, been fun. fun. I'm gonna never do this again. Goodbye. She crosses her arms, a hand on her chin, and cocks her head to one side. Until next time, here's a... Hack on. You stop and look over your shoulder. I am a witch, so be careful. She puts her, fing her finger to her lips with a soft shh. You depart. Not quite sure to what to make of that. Well, she I likes like to you. fuck with mind games, so that's cool. Yeah, it's Wait. Like Bercy now. Was it, wasn't he over here? What happened? Yeah, he moved. You have a moment. As you approach Bercy, he lowers the book he was reading. He doesn't strike you as the book reading type. You're Bercy. You're Hakon. We've gotten that out of the way, haven't we? I had some questions. Say what you want to say. It's, yeah. Where'd you learn to fight? Same as you. By fighting. You know what I mean. 
I robbed well-protected merchants for at least one man's lifetime. Is that what you mean? Yeah. Not anymore. I've had a lot of jobs. What's Avaro doing working for the Luden? Yeah. What's Avaro doing working for another Vaal? What difference does it make? Oh, I, I gave that the wrong inflection. Damn it. It looks like you're in charge now, so do me a favor and don't get Luden killed. He's important to you? No, but that's one way to put it. I mean, he is important, yeah. Mm, no, yeah. I don't think we should bother asking if we trust him. Oh, come on, let's do it. What a loaded question. Depends what you mean. Whose back will you have if things go wrong? I'll assume I'm looking out for myself and you'll figure it out. Does Lude understand that? Loden doesn't even understand that half his army is here to protect him from the people he talks to. <laughs> Sounds wow. right. All right. So I won't keep you any longer. See you on the battlefield, O oh leader of Varl. You could join us. I'm where I want to be. Don't forget what I said about keeping Loden alive. Got it? As you step away, you can't help but wonder if there was a bit of threat behind that gravelly request. All right, well, that is all the time now we, we have. Rest. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you later. Adios.